relatively conservative Republicans, and no matter what the issue is, uh, we have the same general philosophy of government and where we stand on those issues. But here's the difference in the candidates that you see uh, in front of you today. Uh, when we talk about jobs and job creation and economic development, I have actually done something about it. When I served on the Cleveland City Council with George Pope and other members of the Cleveland City Council, we worked as part of a team to bring jobs and development into the community. The, the uh, All Hub Parkway, Home Depot developments, and the businesses that have come around there, that didn't just happen. We all had to work together to make that happen, to clear out bureaucracy, to uh, get the approvals in there, to get the infrastructure, the sewer, the electricity, the roads, those things to make that happen. The same with the McGrady properties on the south end of Bradley County. I was part of the team that worked on the economic development to make that happen as well. And uh, consequently, we've got over 43 businesses that are there today helping uh, bring tax dollars into our community, provide hundreds of jobs for people. And that's an important difference instead of talking about things and doing things. Additionally, I supported and voted to uh, the Economic Development Council of the Chamber of Commerce that also has continued to work to help bring Bakker into our community. We funded that when I was on the city council, and we also rolled back taxes on some business and industry here in Cleveland and Bradley County so that they could afford to invest in our community and continue to, to, to bring jobs to our area and uh, instead of relocating and doing uh, things other places. So that is a key difference. I have an actual record of supporting jobs and job creation. If you send me to Washington, I will continue to work as part of a team with other folks on our national level to promote the economy and good jobs, in our, in, not only in our community, but the whole nation. That's a very important key. Second thing, we talk a lot about fiscal responsibility and managing budgets. I'm the only candidate uh, in this race that has actually managed and create, created and managed public budgets. Every single year, as sheriff, since I have, have been there, we've had a balanced budget, and at the end of the year, we have returned money back to the taxpayers. A demonstrable record of fiscal responsibility. We have got to reduce the national debt. We've got to reduce the deficit spending in Washington. I have a record of not spending uh, in, a, in the deficit category. We, all, we spend less than what we've been budgeted at the Sheriff's Office, and we have made government work for you. I will take that actual record with me to Washington and make government work for you and we'll do it in a physically responsible way and that is a key difference of the candidates in this race. And thirdly, if you will send me to Washington instead of just talking about national security and public safety and homeland security, I've actually done something about it. As a Secret Service agent for 15 years, I protected the President and the Vice President of the United States, the two top terror tar terrorist targets in the world. The places where they go and were, national special security events over and over again, Republican, Democrat, national conventions, Super Bowls, other events that were designated that. I understand and know firsthand the terror threat that this country faces. It is serious, it is dangerous, and we have to have people in Washington who know and understand it and will support those out there every single day that are fighting to protect us. I've worked closely with men and women of our nation's military, and I've worked very closely with the men and women of law enforcement, firefighters, and public safety. I know and understand the terrorist threat that faces this country. Instead of talking about it, I've done something about it. I have the experience to represent you well in Washington. I have the record to represent you well in Washington. And together we will make a difference. Thank you for allowing me to be with you.